What is going on everybody? Zodiac Marksman or Jared here from Zodiac Killer Gaming. I got some free for all gameplay using my ACR with red dot sights and stability and rocking the autumn camo. Um, quick news, uh, I was going and I was working on a montage that I was going to make for Modern Warfare 3 and somehow I have lost all my clips so I'm gonna have to start making you know like new sniper clips and everything so it might be a little bit of a delay on that and uh, I have some campy gameplay here if you don't like me camping you might as well just not even watch this video um, free for all is quite easy for me uh, if I can control one area especially on whatever this map is resistance I think and uh, this, this spot here is like the best I would think because you can control you know one back side of the map and one nice hallway right here and the reason I'm using with red dot and stability is because you usually when you put a red dot by itself on the ACR there's just there's no stability at all but when you make it well when you use the stability proficiency with it it is like impossible for there to be any, any sway at all so I could be even more accurate with my shots without my my bullets going everywhere and I could just make more precise shots. I'm using the assault kill streaks. I really never do that. But I'm starting to do that if I was going to raise my KD. Um, I hope you guys like that watermark in the lower left hand corner. I, I really uh, put some time into making that perfect. I'm just messing with you. It took me like five minutes to do. But um, I think it's a whole lot better having a watermark in the lower left hand corner than having something up in the right hand corner. It uh, is less, you know, in the way. Um, I really don't know what perks I was using here. I think I was using a uh, blind eye, assassin, uh, maybe stalker for sure. Um, also, in Black Ops 2 news, I think there. Well, actually, let's go over some Black Ops stuff. Uh, I heard in Black Ops 2 there's not going to be a stalker perk, and that is really going to affect my gameplay, so I really like using stalker, it's a really good perk to use, uh, it helps me, you know, aim down corners and uh, be able to expect the unexpected when I'm going around a corner, and Another thing with Black Ops 2, I really hope there's another explosive crossbow in there. I heard the zombies are supposed to be really nice. Uh, hopefully, and the customization uh, for the multiplayer classes, I heard there's going to be like a 10 point system or something with like, you get to have like, un there's like a l unlimited customization, but I hope they don't mess up like they did in Black Ops. They let you customize all types of things, but they got the gameplay wrong. And what I mean by that is, is that, in my opinion, Black they on Black Ops, you know, they didn't really focus on gameplay. They focused on customizing things and nerfing every gun that was possible. The first week of Black Ops was a good was a good was really good. I really liked Black Ops the first week. About gotten into maybe three weeks into Black Ops, it, I started noticing things. There was a lot of patching going on. There was a lot of guns being nerfed. And, you know, it's really not fun using one whole magazine in a gun to kill somebody and then there's another person right next to him and then you have to reload. Um, unlike that, in Modern Warfare 3 or any Infinity Wars games, you could use a whole magazine and kill four people without even having to reload. Um, that'll be my last death there. Sorry about that. If it, uh, you guys don't care about deaths at all. But I really want there to be a Black Ops where it's, it's more fair if bullets did more damage than it taking seven to six bullets to kill somebody in black ops and then sometimes it would just there wouldn't be any sometimes i mean it would take three bullets to kill somebody and then it would be like oh i'm just gonna get a, like five hit markers across the map with my galil 
for my commando and it really I really hope they don't make the same mistake and also that uh, if you guys seen that sniper rifle that shot through walls and stuff and at E3 that was that's pretty cool but if they have that in the multiplayer I promise you there will not be any gameplay on this channel <laughs> no I'm messing with you there'll be gameplay on this channel there just won't be any of that sniper gameplay if there's in freaking multiplayer I would really hate that but but um, as I was saying like four weeks into the game there was just they were starting to nerf all the guns nerfing the explosives and it just it just got it got to be a terrible game and I didn't want to play it anymore because I didn't enjoy seven to eight bullets to kill somebody across the map or up close um, this game is gonna wrap up in about one kill I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay slash commentary about uh, black ops a little bit just a little bit of black ops talk black ops 2 talk I guess you can forward slash doesn't matter um, yeah I think it took me a while to get this this predator missile because I really wanted the predator missile to be the last kill cam Also, using uh, using kick and uh, the red side isn't too bad if you're using uh, stalker. And you see, stalker helped me get that last kill right there, or that kill there. And there it is, everybody. 30 and 1 gameplay, free for all. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe. Enjoy, subscribe, whatever. I'll see you guys later.